Nasal polyps are really markers of inflammation in the nose. There can be one sort of large polyp. You can have many different sites where polyps form. Occasionally we will see people with polyps coming from the tissue in the nose, but much more commonly the polyps come from the tissue in the sinuses. Polyps end up being in about 30% of folks with chronic sinus disease. That ends up being a pretty large number. There are lots of different reasons why people probably have nasal polyps. We only know sort of a few, a very small number of them. Um, a lot of people think that allergy might be the main factor in developing polyps, but the studies that have been done don't bear that out. It's only about half of them have, around half of them have allergies uh, as diagnosed by allergy testing. And some other very specific causes, there's some defects in metabolic pathways that can cause polyp formation. Uh, there certainly is genetic predisposition uh, to polyp formation as well. Generally, the things that people notice most with nasal polyps are uh, inability to breathe through the nose or poor nasal airflow um, and decreased smell. Uh, smell seems to be a pretty sensitive indicator of the amount of inflammation in someone's nose and it's a good way to actually follow polyp patients. If one of my polyp patients comes in and their smell is decreased, well there's a good chance that there's some polyps that have grown back. Uh, lots of times people get good benefit from steroids and then they, we can get them feeling pretty well for a while. Um, unfortunately, a lot of the times those symptoms come back and the polyps, once you come off the steroids, the polyps seem to regrow. Most of the time, what I try to do is try to figure out if we can find out why they do have the polyps and then if we can remove that causative factor. If we can't find a cause, most of the time uh, we're trying to see what they respond to. If we do all those things and the polyps are still there and people are still symptomatic, then we, we frequently will end up considering surgery.